greetings and salutations, folks, and welcome back to Red Dead Redemption 2, where now we're going to help out Leopold Strauss. You know, I would imagine that saving um, Micah is probably more pressing, but I also would imagine that's going to be more... Um, that's going to be the thing that moves the story forward more. Once I save... Once I complete this uh, task for uh, Leopold, once I save Micah, then the story is going to open up some more. Um, let's see what this guy... Mr. Strauss, you busy, my friend? Why? I'll cut you in. Loaning. Already? You know how it is. People is happy to borrow off someone like me, but more enthusiastic paying back to someone like you. Of course. Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. Let me see. A Chick Matthews works at Guthrie Farm. He's a hand, I believe. Mr. Roble, the small holder at Painted Sky. Uh, this seems sounds like busy work. Badly. Miss Lily Millet is a ranch maid up at Emerald Ranch. And here was me believing Dutch's bluster about us helping folk. It's legal work, Mr. Morgan. Debtors belong in prison. We are doing them a favor. Ah, I'll make sure they see it in them terms. Put the debts in the deed box and try not to kill them. It's very bad for business. Okay. Reclaim a debt from these debtors. Truly, the gift we're giving to the people is... Dues owed. But let's get over to our horse and make our way to one of these people who owe us money. Okay, so Mr. Robel uh, seems to be the one that's closest to camp. I don't remember what his job was, but none of them necessarily seem like they are well into money anyway. Um, like you got a ranch's hand and a ranch maid. So... Now, supposedly I can get a... I can... What have you been looking for? Yeah. I'm sure uh, he's not doing anything particularly important. Um, so I've... I don't know what... I'm guessing this quest is acts as kind of like a tutorial quest for other lending activities. Possibly like a... Also, you can say it's probably a... Oh, nope, nope. Put it... Oh, jeez. There we go. Let's see. Is Strauss... Or should I say... Is this person... In here? God damn it. English? Uh, you speak English? Me, uh, <laughs> Silesia. Yeah, good uh, for you. Silesia. I'm here for money. Do you borrow from a German man? Aha, uh, German. Uh, um, uh, mein Herr, uh, uh, sprechen das, uh, this, uh, uh, the nah, Kaiserreich. I don't yeah? speak German neither. I'm here for money. Money. I speak green. From Leopold Strauss. Uh-huh. 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 Leopold Strauss. Uh -huh. Ah, at least, at least, at least we know names. Where is it? Oh, well, no, I have nothing. It's very bad winter. We've all had a bad winter, pal. Oh. Ah. Where is it? Oh. Oh. No, no, nye, nye. All right. Threaten. Now you remember where you're keeping that silver. Potrzebuję trochę czasu. Znajdę ci pieniądze. Oh, okay. Punch. Punch. Where is the money? And then threaten again. Oh, dollars. 
would, would you have this? Excuse me, sir. It's good. It's good. It's valuable. It's, it's Varsava, yes. I have your things. Okay? I have anything in here or out there. Yes. So do I antagonize or do I rob him? How much money do these people actually owe? I don't think I was actually provided this information. Gold wedding ring. What do we have here? Just keep quiet. Truly, this is a service. Cigarettes? Ah, uh, sure, why not? No, 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 no. Yes, 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 yes. Oh my gosh. Do I need to search every individual? Oh. Anything? Nothing. Nope, nope, chest. You know, I, I figured it would, pa it would, uh, the option would show up. Longer I look, the madder I get. And there's nothing in there. How about in here? Fine brandy. Debt of sex uh, successfully recovered. I took absolutely zero things that you could eat, so... Like, you can't eat the wedding ring, you can't eat the cigarettes, and you can't eat the, uh... the fine brandy, so... I might as well just drop this off, yep. since it's on my way. Uh, the next two Depters are going to be on the east side of uh, Horseshoe, so I might as well just knock those two off back to back. But this doesn't feel like it's going to be a particularly dangerous mission, although maybe I'm calling it a little bit too soon. <gasps> like he says, try not to kill anybody. Which sounds as though it might happen by accident. It, like, uh, there's nothing in the game telling me that I couldn't just shoot uh, that guy back there. Um, but it would be dishonorable. Oh, okay. It automatically uh, collected the stuff from me. I, I imagine. I think you bastards missed me. <laughs> Even you, Arthur. Arthur. Even you. Oh, Arthur. Do you seem in a good mood? I am, son. I am. Let's have some fun. Oh. Let's enjoy ourselves. Are we having a party? Maybe. Just a little one. Great. All right. I'll keep them girls in line. Mr. If I have to whip them, I will. So come on. Let's have ourselves a party. And don't you worry, Mr. Pearson, you drunk old shitbag. It'll be nothing but... What exactly do these people do as a party at the camp? Now, dead eye Maguire's back. And don't worry about nothing, Mrs. Grimshaw. We'll have this camp running like clockwork. I love you, bastards. Have fun. Have oh, love. and then there's the Irishman. <laughs> Even you, you grumpy old bastard. 
bastard out of town. Let's enjoy ourselves. Uh oh, here comes trouble. I just can't get rid of you, can I? The gang are celebrating the safe return of Sean and will be unavailable for other activities for a while. Okay. You're looking lovely as ever, if I may say so. Oh, stop it. Imagine riding with him all the way from Blackwater to here. This stupid. Is there things for me to do? Or am I just more or less kind of wandering around a camp while they do things? I don't think Arthur is going to be able to carry a tune. Eh, better than you'd expect. Although I suppose exactly the amount of uh, quality you really need uh, if you want to be a cowboy in the West. These, this, uh, this song was probably quite scandalous in its day. <laughs> okay. Uh, it appears as though uh, this guitar player just floated off of his seat. I suppose, uh, like, interludes like this kind of give the impression, uh, at the very least, the illusion that the camp is, exists as a community. Uh, rather than just kind of like a frozen, isolated patch of gameplay. Let's see what's going on at the campfire real quick. I was going to rest by the campfire. What? Hello. Hello. What do you want? I'm not... I'm not quite sure. Oh. This keeps happening. Um... I'm not entirely sure I really want to know what keeps happening. Um, is what you, what it keeps happening, you just get drunk and then you end up near, uh, nearly killing yourself? Um. Why did you bring me over here? All right, I'm going back to the campfire. This is quite mysterious.
Shall we dance? Whoever this person is, Mary Beth. What is flair? That's a lot of flair. I don't know. It's okay to dance. Doesn't mean we won't stop thinking you're angry and sad. Well, what you think of me? <laughs> sad in a good way, like a romantic poet. Well, that's about all I can muster. <laughs> And more flair. Maximum amount of flair. Non stop flair. You, you can't even you can't even stop this flair. He's just sick from all the flair. Okay, that's enough of that. And she I rewards him with a crumb. Alright. Well, thank you, sir. Thank you again well, for course. the dance, Miss Gaskell. Anytime. You're better than I thought you'd be. That's what she said. Alright, what on earth is going on here? There's Susan. Where did uh Marston go? Let's just finish. Uh, let's just sleep our way till the morning. Uh, get back on track. This this party has distracted us from collecting from debtors. Although that's something I was talking about the other time. Like so many different systems in this game are just conflicting with each other. It's like you've got this quest that's going on. Chick Matthews and Lily Millet. Oh, uh, you got this quest that's going on. And then it gets interrupted by another set of quests. So actually, that probably means that I haven't uh, contributed that debt uh, to... Uh, uh, to the camp, as uh, was quested. I probably will still have to remember exactly what I picked up. So I picked up a golden wedding ring, a fine brandy, and a, a pack of cigarettes. Alright, now here I'm looking for someone named Chick Matthews. Sir. Ah, damn it. You owe us money. Come on, girl. Ah, yep. There's the tutorial I was waiting for. I have yet to... I used the lasso to capture myself, um... Somebody, once earlier on in the game. Um, but it's been a while. I'm probably getting prepared a little bit too soon. Oh no, you've been stopped by a train. You make me go much further. I'll get more than a dead off you. Leave it, alright? There we go. 
There we go. Let's hog tie this chick Matthews. Look, look, I got the money, but it's hidden. Untie me and I'll tell you where it is. You're no place to bargain, boy. Just untie me, I'll tell you. Okay, okay. There's a map. It's in my pocket. A map? Why can't none of you fools just pay? Uh, you don't mind, do you? Goddamn treasure hunt? You're lucky I ain't taking your teeth as well. Oh my god. Where is uh, his trick? Well, aren't you gonna untie me? Nope, I'm going to pick you up and then put you on the horse. You got the map. Do the decent thing. Let's go for a ride. All right, let's see where this destination, hopefully this destination happens to be where I need to go in order to find this treasure. Then I will find the treasure, uh, take it for my person, and release Chick Matthews. If I had a guess... Probably this tree over here. Yep. Maybe. Yeah, his debt money. All right. I got my money. He can go about his business. You good? All right, now that leaves. Oh, the Emerald Ranch. I've been there before. Lily Millet. Um, I went to the Emerald Ranch uh, earlier for a side quest. I found a, a woman who uh, whose horse had died. Uh, on the side of the road, gave her a ride back to her place, which, lo and behold, was the Emerald Ranch. But now somebody there owes money. said you love me. I do. I do, but what I get I think I got caught myself caught in another situation. Your money's got to be your problem now. The only problem I got is this Oh my gosh. going on in my ear. Now lay off it, Lily. God damn it. All right, now Lily Millet, I got to talk to you about some money. What? That loan you took. It's payday. I'm sorry. I don't have it right now. Well, then, I guess we got a big problem, don't we? Cooper, give him what you've got. I ain't giving him nothing except a lessening damn money. Son of a bitch. That was my hat that I had stolen off of a dead body.
Is there a way to fight him without killing him? Nope. Alright, thanks Ellie. It's good doing business. Um, where did my hat go? Hey, you know what I do to thieves? You got your money, leave me alone. I didn't steal that, it's a debt. Oh, damn it. <laughs> oh great. Greetings and salutations, sir. I'd like to discuss. I'd like to discuss what you have just seen. Don't run from me. Keep your mouth shut, or you're dead, friend. Stop! Don't do this! You gonna leave this or not? Don't do this! Okay, you better have heard me. Or make me teach you another lesson. Get You're away. a son of a bitch. This may be true. This may, in fact, be true, but um, I, I ain't got no time for more lessons. I got debts to. Oof. Like I can, I can definitely see how vaguely legal. Ooh. That is a good dog. Can I pet the dog? Can I pet the dog? Oh, nope. Come back, dog. I want to pat. Come here. Damn it. Why must everything in this game be difficult? Hey, boy. You can pet the dog in Red Dead Redemption 2. Okay. Now let's go uh, repay the zip. And and that's... Uh, like, without a system in, like, in which, uh, like, there are debt collectors besides people who... Thugs who show up uh, to beat... Uh, to beat up the debtors. And if there are no... What did I accidentally do? Okay, let's try that again. If there's no system to, like, protect uh, people in debt, then... And there's no system for people to collect debts, then really it just allows a person, uh, like somebody like Leopold Strauss, to claim legality. He claims that he's, uh, he's in the right. Uh, so that somebody like Arthur Morgan can show up and just grab the yeah. shiny possessions that somebody happens to have in their home. Uh, chase them down, hog tie them, steal their... just take their funds. But at the same time, it's like... In this era, like, you have... I guess you have to have some sort of idea as to... The debt, the things that, that that we were getting in when you take out a loan, like you're not taking out a loan from a bank when you're taking a loan from Leopold Strauss. You don't know who he is, who he works with. So you could, you could, I, I guess you have to question like why did she choose to go? with Leopold Strauss. Probably because she wouldn't have been able to get a loan from the bank. Um, would, would be the first guess, but at the same time it's like... With so many gangs in this area who will just shoot you and rob you on sight, um, I would be suspicious of anybody not affiliated with any sort of larger government body.
simply because like they could be part of the O'Driscolls or they could be part of Dutch's gang and even like Dutch's gang like Arthur criticizes the O'Driscolls for their methods and their methodology but at the same time like he's going around getting drunk whooping and rooting tooting a whooping and a hollering shooting anything in sight so whatever claims that the Dutch's game have in regards to their behavior uh, they're generally false claims they're not necessarily better people than the people around them they're they're just there to make the most of it and take what is not nailed down uh, whether it's by lying or stealing dealing or wheeling like Leopold Strauss puts on the airs of a more legal approach but he still has the I'm going to But, like, he still is more or less... There's little that separates him from, say, a 1930s mobster. Oh, oh, son of a... Gee, oh. Can I... Oh. How do I get this? There we go. Finally. Sometimes it's a l He probably shouldn't have drank so much. Now the donation box is on the other side of Dutch. <laughs> oh, it's true. It's true. All right, so I don't even have to remember uh, what I had acquired. You receive a cut of each recovered debt you give to camp funds. All right. Contribute camp funds and sunnies, ten upgrades, and no additional utilities. You manage money and decide what the camp buys. Use the ledger to purchase a camp upgrade. Ah, uh, okay. Some more unlocks. <clears throat> Browse to the next page to, uh... Strauss's medicine wagon. Provisions wagon. We got breasts, bread and biscuits. Ooh, ammunition and arms. That's going to be useful. And we got lodging. Dutch wants something comfier. Got a chicken coop. Some local farms are selling off old coop. Leather working tools. I need that, actually. But I kind of want an armory first. Or do I want leather working tools? I'm going to go for leather working tools. How did you get on, Herr Morgan? Fine. Our accounts are up to date. Sad sacks, a lot of them. Good, very good. My pleasure. Uh, well, if it's pleasure you're after, there is one other. This farmer preacher fellow I met in Valentine, Mr. Downs. The opinionated little do-gooder? Yeah, I know the one. I certainly know the type. Thank you, Herr Morgan. There's no need to thank me. Like you said, it's pleasure I'm after. He's more slippery than he seems. I've tried being polite. Don't take any nonsense. Nonsense? Me? If he doesn't have the money, beat him. Well, I usually do. I know. I know. Thank you for watching. Questions? Comments? 
recommendations for something to play next? Comment down below or send it on over to it sounded good on paper at gmail.com. That's it sounded good on paper at gmail.com. So long for now.